Good morning, everybody. Um, first of all, I wanted to thank everybody for the tremendous support, all the comments. Y'all y'all leave some really great comments um, on my videos and things that I can use to uh, help improve my homestead. Um, I, I, I might not be able to get to all the video, I mean, all the comments, but I definitely want to acknowledge that um, I'm, I'm reading them, I'm seeing them, and y'all have some really great uh, feedback, so I, I truly appreciate that. Um, I got my phone here. I might be looking down at it from time to time. If you don't know, um, when you deal with uh, mental health issues um, and your, you know, your your anxiety and depression have, have worked on you for a while, you may end up having a little bit of memory issues, and so. Um, I do have those memory issues. And so I can't always remember what I want to say. So I wrote down some notes for me, even in my videos that I shoot in the garden and around the homestead. If you notice me looking at my phone, it's not because I don't know what I'm talking about. It's just, I want to make sure that I cover all the points that um, I'm trying to cover in that video. Um, so, this week's a huge week, busy week. Um, last week I got monetized on, on YouTube, which is pretty awesome. Um, I was, I got serious about YouTube uh, maybe two months ago. I've had the channel for about a year now, but um, before I was just sporadically posting stuff. And this year, you know, like I said, about two months ago, maybe three, I got serious about it and I learned a lot. And then, um, my goal was to start posting two videos a week. And I'm to that point where I can consistently put out two videos a week. Um, going forward, it will be two to three videos. It may be two videos like my normal videos and one video like this. Um, but anyway, I was planning that I would maybe get monetized next year, like February, you know, that's how, how my analytics was looking. But um, it really blew up here recently, so I accomplished that really, really fast. So on that note, you know, I want to thank everybody who tuned in, everybody who um, has been liking my videos and commenting, because that's the reason why I've started getting more views and, and more, um, uh, you know, more uh, subscribers and whatnot. So um, I truly appreciate it. Um, this video, this this video today is going to be about um, kind of like what my plan is for the upcoming future, um, the, the the near future, and I'm thinking at this point maybe every month I may sit down and do a video kind of like this. It may get to the point where I'm doing this video once a week, but I'm not there yet. So um, I'll, I'll shoot for once a month at least. Um, so this week, let's take this week, I am working on videos normally with my transplants after I'm done with them. I normally, you know, after I've planted what I'm going to plant, I just throw the other ones out and give them to the chickens or rabbits or whoever. Well, this year I decided to make a change on that and I'm going to do container gardening for the first time. So I will be coming out with a video on container gardening this week um my rabbit watering system i did not show y'all that in that video of homestead efficiencies so what i want to do is it's time for me to clean out the the, the hoses but this time i'm going to swap out the hoses from the clear hoses to the black hoses and i'll go over that in the video um also it's coming up real close on time where I need to pick my sweet potatoes. 
I'm not sure if I'm going to get to that this week, but I will try to and go over um, just some some benefits of, of sweet potatoes and whatnot and, and how I go about harvesting them. Coming up soon, I'm really excited about it, is I will be, I ordered some trees from TN Nursery. This is the first time I've gone through them, but they've got pretty pretty good reviews. So I went on ahead and went through them. I normally go, if you're here in Georgia, I normally go with Olson, Olson's Nursery. Um, I'll, I'll pop up in the video to, to who I'm talking about, but they are awesome and they have great customer service and they're family owned here local in Georgia. If you're looking for any type of trees or vines or shrubs, that kind of thing, look look at look at them. They didn't particularly have the one that I bought from TN Nursery, so that's why I went with TN Nursery. They just mailed them out. It should be here either this week or next week. So uh, be prepared for a video on uh, planting trees and how I water them and the whole nine. Um, and the last thing that I'm working on this week is, well, not this week, but once probably the last video out of those that I talked about is that I will be doing a, um, a homestead tour, kind of going around showing you all the different animals, um, the different growing locations and that kind of thing. I do have a, two gardens that I need to clear out still. And I'll probably do a video on those, um, how I set them to bed. Oh, one, I'm planting a cover crop in. Um, I'll put uh, up on the screen what I'm planting in those. And then the other one, I already planted a cover crop, but I still got some peppers over there. So I'm gonna take the peppers out. They're, they're, I'm done with peppers for the year. And then I'll be able to finish terminating that plot and uh, put it to rest for the fall and, and summer, I mean, fall and winter. Then that will come. Those will, those two gardens that I put to sleep will come back for spring, early season is when I, next time I'll plant in those. Until then, it's just going to be the backyard garden. Um, I I probably will do another video on on the backyard garden, showing you how things have, have been coming along. I'll probably put that in with my container gardening uh, video. But um, yeah, I just wanted to get on here real quick and kind of talk to you guys and and let you know what's coming up. Uh, let you know um, kind of where I'm at with the homestead. Oh, well, you got you got the man stealing the show, you know, in front of me. But I'm also going to be doing a video soon on my asparagus. Um, I planted asparagus from seed last, well, this spring. And so I'll be having to show you um, what the asparagus looks like now and then how I get it ready for the for the winter weather. Other than that, if y'all have any um, anything that, you know, that maybe I'm missing, okay, buddy, that y'all might want to, you know, see in a video, please let me know. Um, hey girl, she don't, she don't let me touch her. You don't really let me touch him either. You see how he went sideways? <laughs> uh, the flock's doing well. I like all the different variety. You know, I don't have a bunch of one particular type. So I like all the different varieties and they, for the most part, get along. Um, I know most of the video, y'all probably been just watching them anyway. I'm I'm the I'm the background noise in the video, so <laughs> but no things are going great on the homestead. A lot of a lot of um new opportunities are arising. I'm really looking forward to um to branching out a bit. I, I have to take it slow though, because I know myself and I'll just start jumping into stuff and Next thing you know, I won't get anything done because I've been just jumping all around. But with um, the roadside stand, I think I've figured out my design that I want to go with. 
And so now I'm going to start putting stuff together to kind of makeshift it and see if that looks like what I want it to look like. But it's going to be pretty awesome. I'm looking forward to that. A lot of people uh, have been asking about um, when I'm going to be doing the roadside stand and whatnot. It won't be till the spring. I don't know a exact date yet. I don't know exactly when stuff is going to be ready. Hey, hey. What y'all doing? What you doing? You just looking at me? Um, I don't know when things will be ready just yet, but um, it probably will be early in the spring. And the earlier it is in the spring, probably the less variety that I'll have. But going through the spring, I'll be adding stuff probably every week to the uh, to the roadside stand. So I'm I'm really excited about that. I think. Um, it's going to do really well, and I'm most excited that I'll be able to meet some of you, you know, um, in person at the stand. And, you know, if I'm if I'm not carrying something that you like at the stand, please let me know when you come. Um, that way I can switch things up or start growing some other things and whatnot. I'm probably going to leave a patch of one of the gardens empty just for that reason, because I want to be able to provide... Um, the things that you want so anyway i'm gonna get off here i didn't want this video to be too long just wanted to cover some of the things that are coming up uh some of the things that are going on with me in the homestead here oh got me a deer yesterday got me a buck um i'll try to put some some i don't think i can put the video up but i think i can put maybe i don't know if i'm gonna be able to put it up on the on the uh on the video but i did get me a buck and He's with the taxidermist, taxidermist right now, so I can most definitely show you the, uh, the finished product when that comes back. So, um, anyway, let me get off here. I'm going to keep rambling. Y'all have a blessed day. I really appreciate it. Don't forget, check out my affiliate links below. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm, I'm coming out with a lot of videos here soon, so it's... Uh, it's going to be moving pretty, pretty fast, and I'm definitely, definitely here for it. So y'all take care, and I'll see you in the next video.